Yes, so I am working on establishing a human cellular model in which we can try and investigate inflammatory crosstalk because we do think it starts uh, with the microglia, they get into a reactive state, as I just was saying, it could be to do with the uh, reacting to the um, amyloid or tau proteins, they build up over time. Uh, it could also, we've just heard talk today about the gut micro biome and how that even might trigger uh, inflammation in, in the brain, even though it comes from the gut. So that was really, really interesting. Um, yeah, and then, then I, wanna, I wanna be able to look at how microglia interact with the next cell type being astrocytes and how they might uh, be causing neurodegeneration. So I have a system where I'm looking at microglia, astrocytes and neurons and they're all derived from uh, human pluripotent stem cells. Currently my research has been focused on trying to replicate some findings that are already out there uh, with uh, traditional methods of inducing inflammation, for example using L LPS. Um, and I have so far shown that yes, I can generate a reactive uh, astrocyte state by treating microglia first with LPS, taking that conditioned media off and treating the astrocytes with it. Uh, I am now then going to continue to see if the reactive astrocyte media I've made, whether that then causes uh, degeneration of neurons.